Hello and welcome back to Europa Universalis 4. I am Lord Forrand, here playing, of course, as the Aztec. So we've got a little colony going in Africa now, and we're going to snag some other provinces here. Start steering, if possible, some trade to the Caribbean. Um, let's see. Right now we got one gold coming to Caribbean. Obviously we don't control the Caribbean, so that's a bit of an issue. Um, I should also continue building a fleet, shouldn't I, now that I think about it. Uh, let's do five heavies. Is that something we can afford periodically? Um, so we're also working our way towards getting manufacturers, the institution. Um, it's taking a little while. Uh, this guy's not such a genius ruler, I don't mind putting him in the field. We just got a new ruler. He is luckily righteous, which helps. Unfortunately, our sustaining the gods does not give us a republican tradition, which is frustrating. But it would be too strong if it did, to be honest. Portugal is spying on us. England is fabricating claims, which is making me a little nervous, to be honest. Um, does that mean we can get diplo power? No, not yet. Five more years, I guess. We'll do that. We've got a attack coming up on Florida in three years or less. Less than three years. There you go. Uh, California has formed, which means at some point we can take the French colonies out there. Let's dev our capital a little bit more. This is to 50. We're halfway there. It's only costing us almost 100 now. 107 now. Oy, oy, oy. Unfortunately, we already used the Expand Aztec, but we kind of needed to at some point. Slowly converting the new world. I mean, we're making some pretty good progress. Fortunately, I'm going to have to control inflation again. There we go. Rein that in a little bit. Ooh, there's some good production. Still want to build more uh, manufacturers, obviously, but... Uh, A lot of other little things that are positive to do. Uh, I could actually wipe these guys out now, couldn't I? Just looking around and trying to find which of these native alliances I can actually reach and fight, because the last thing I want to do is start fighting wars where I can't take land. So it looks like I can now take land from these two, the Apache and the Zuni. That would give me less enemies in the New World, if not actual... Oh wait, we're allied to the Apache. Eh. Not like they've done anything for us lately. 64% done. This colony over here is almost already finished. We're gonna have to put some uh, tree buildings and stuff out here. Get some more power going to the new world. It's unfortunate that I think all the centers of trade were already picked up. Ooh, this one wasn't. Uh, where's my navy? We want to snag that center of trade after this colony finishes. There we go. Hopefully my ships will arrive first. They should. And then we can swiftly race our people over. It's already here. There we go. Only slightly damaged by crossing the Atlantic. Unload in Calabar. There we go. Run you back to there. Parse treat all those natives if you would. Yep. Perfect. Colonists will be there soon. General died while drilling. Of course he did. Can't 
can't get a new one yet. Oh well. We have an option to get standardized uniforms. Nope. 80% of the way towards the institution. We've got it being, like, growing in this province, but it's only gotten to 41, so... Ayer. Why do you want an alliance? Are you big? Are you small? I don't know. If they're big, I'll take them as an ally. Um... What would that area be? It's not going to be Guinea. It's going to be... Niger? It's going to be Niger. I just can't get... Any maps. Okay. Apparently I just turned them down. Okay. Niger region. Please let me see what's up there. Ayer is reasonably large, but has been losing land to Kano. I have no idea what's going on here. Nobles. I think they've got a rebellion issue, do you? They seem to be being a bit overwhelmed by the European, uh, by noble rebels. Okay. Not someone I really need to ally. These guys are guaranteed by France, so they would not be the worst allies. What's the tech look like? They're the tech leaders of the region, so... France declared war! Or... My African colony. Okay. Here we go. Technically not in the... New World, really. I guess. You could make that argument. I can't actually march there. Um, I can send you to California, though. I'll march this guy south. The thing we gotta be wary of now is the other Europeans wanting our lands. Um, yeah. Oh, we sank one of the French ships. Russia's got internal problems. Then again, when doesn't Russia seem to have internal problems? Historically, it seems like Russia has a lot of internal issues. Let's see if this will work. Uh, yep. I don't know why I didn't actually fight their navy there. We kind of... ships passing in the night there a bit. Twenty-nine. Okay. I'll occupy this land, I guess. Um, can we march down here yet? No. Okay, that's fine, I guess. They're gonna wipe out my army there unless I run. Doesn't look like they're gonna be a big threat up there. Another general on the field. Uh, I can put a claim on these guys. Let's just quick do that before I forget. Put this on probably outraged countries. Keep them happy. As much as possible. Oh, the Apache, I forgot, are going to join me in this war. So that'll be nice. We only need a white piece, to be honest. Although, if I could snag one of these French colonies in Africa, I'd be more than happy with that. Or even just California. As long as we control the war goal, we should be okay until they land a uh, death stack there. Okay, let's boost Mexico once more. 
Never have too much money. We are one development away from getting the institution started. Awesome. Just spend that little bit of Monarch points. Um, up to Merwak there. Can I steal more maps from Great Britain? Probably. Can I steal California? Yes. Just want to know what's up here so I can actually occupy it in a reasonable speed. France has sent five, four units. Let's flip a general around. We should be able to win this fight. I hope. They have better discipline, but we have better morale, and for right now, morale is still king. Stack wiped. Awesome. Okay, um, where are we looking? Should probably wipe out this little army they've got running around California. I'll let the Apache worry about occupying. Ah, 18, 18 stack. The French are here. I don't have military. Nobody has military access yet, though. Yeah, I'm going to lose Karu. That's annoying. I was worried about that. I was hoping that the European wouldn't declare war for a uh, singular colony in uh, Africa, but... I guess they did. Okay. Well, let's let time tick forward. Ooh, there's actual French troops up there. Can I get you? Eleven out of forty-six needed. They are landing troops. Can I? It's only transports. I say it's only transports, but I'm not winning, am I? Ah, it's over. Unless I raise mercs, but even still, I think I can get enough mercs to beat that French army. Maybe. We'll try it. Can hardly hurt, so. Of course, the French ran past my army. That's pretty typical for the AI. Anything else I can do here? Nope. We're just gonna lose this fight. Or I can run away, so I will run away. <laughs> um, we lost our navy, of course. Kind of a stare down here. Hmm, okay, um... What do I do? I guess I just keep colonizing North America? 
Clearly, I can't win this. The question is... Will they just take that one colony, or will they want more? I'll concede Cal Colonial California, which involves all of that. No. We will drag this out if need be. We can win a land war. Uh, let's get the institution going in our capital first. Gotcha. Advancement effort. We just have to outlast California, pretty much. And uh, France in general. Just hold the new world until... Still don't have access to some of these British provinces, which I guess is good. In the meantime, this Burk army, I guess, will rebuild a bit. Dead ruler. His replacement isn't that great, but not terrible either. I'm going to use up some of this admin power. Actually core some of these provinces. Really wish the French would just leave so I can reoccupy land. Speaking of other stuff though, let's see, I've got 6.8 in my capital. It's a lot of development in one province. Oh, I'm exiled officially, so now that I'm exiled, where in the world would I want to go with this army? I might just disband it, to be honest. Well, our great African plan failed pretty badly actually um, if they want I'll give them Karu but that's about it okay time to fight France in the new world because we're not giving all those up Spanish Canada has now rivaled me great Yeah, we have a bit of a problem. The French have insane levels of discipline right now. Compared to us. And we're no slouch. Can I counter-rival Colonial, Colonial Canada? I can't while I'm at war, obviously. Okay. Always forget that that's a thing. Really need a different advisor. Discipline. Okay, that'll be better. We're on par with the French in terms of morale. It's discipline we're weaker in, so that helps quite a bit. Build another small army there while I've got time and money. Throw down another two manufactories. Let's see, how many troops does France have in general? Um, we know where... Wow, that's a lot of cannon. Um, I might have even been able to win that one if I had charged. I've only got 12 troops, infantry troops there. Which means most of their army is still sitting in the old world. Otherwise I'd try a sneaky little landing to uh, pick up land, but... Right now that would just die. Our big hope here is really just to outlast them. 
At some point, they're going to get tired of the war. Or they're going to land more troops here, which is actually fine with me, because we can win these fights now. They're my ruler. I prefer not to have you die, I guess. Yeah. We're on par with the French. Almost. Not quite, but pretty close. Not oh, rebels. Of course there's rebels. Come on, let me march. There we go. As long as we constantly win these battles in California, we should be able to balance out the war score, given time. Of course, my whole goal was to invade Canada, but clearly that's been delayed. Get a little bit more manpower coming in, because obviously that's going to be a bit of an issue against a war against France, of all people. France is unhappy about the war now. What is going on in France that would make them so unhappy? Length of war. Uh, uh, we're going to continue it till they really want peace. We'll see if they're crazy enough to actually land a substantial army I can stack wipe, because that would be very nice to see. There we go. That puts us more income and everything. Those little French armies, though, are going to be a problem, given time. Oh, they've moved their army out of there, but I doubt I'll be able to get a landing force through. I have one transport. Let's say we send, like, one division over there of a merc. Maybe it'll succeed, maybe it won't. I doubt it'll succeed. Um, we got five galleons to support it, though. Is that worth it? How strong is the French Navy? A lot stronger than I am. Okay. We'll try this. This is very reckless. But if we can pick up that one province, the war will definitely be over. Yeah, I won't contest it. State religion will do this. Increased conversion, which will be better for our religious unity than the 70%, hopefully. Come on, Navy. Come on, Suicide Squad, basically. Come on, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. You just need to recover your manpower. Are you going to recover enough manpower? Ever? Come on. Next month, probably. This navy's got a retreat. Hopefully it doesn't die. Mm. 
looks like it's going to succeed. Huh. Still no peace, but we have managed to recapture that land. And more stupidly, the French are going to land their army on top of mine. Okay, that was dumb, no matter how you look at it. That should be enough for a white piece. Question is, if we go a little bit longer here, can we get these colonies? I'm going to try. We'll see. Oh, wants me to take the Diplo tech. Um, 19 tech penalty though, so it's not worth it. Um, could I develop this province? Uh, it's not helping, is it? I guess we'll just save it. We can get up to over a thousand, so we should be good on that front. Heresy, of course, has popped up. We've just got to wait a little bit here till we get enough war score. But I think we'll end this here because this is going to take time probably to take the war score up. After this, we're going to go after Florida and Canada. And maybe British Columbia now that we actually have more access to their lands. And uh, once we do that, we'll be in a much stronger position to think about invading Europe. So that's it from me. Thank you guys all for watching, and bye for now.